Hello again, my name is Gabe Zolna. This is the 13th of February 2019. Just read an article on CBS News written by Emily Tillett, that's T-I-L-L-E-T-T. -T. Title, Tread Cruz wants drug kingpins El Chempo to fund Trump's border wall. While Washington continues to debate funding over President Trump's long-promised border wall along the southern border, Senator Ted Cruz of Republican Texas says he has a solution for financing. Half-convicted drug lord Joaquin El Chapo Guzman foot the bill. Cruz tweeted the proposal after Guzman was found guilty on all ten counts in his criminal conspiracy and drug trafficking trial saying that the $14 billion in drug profits U.S. prosecutors are seeking from the infamous drug lord should go towards funding our wall to secure the border. Cruz urged his colleagues in Capitol Hill to pass his El Chapo Act, which he previously reintroduced early last month. The ensuing lawful collection of hidden assets to provide order El Chapo Act would reserve any amounts forfeited to the U.S. government as a result of the criminal prosecution of El Chapo and any other drug lords for border security assets and the completion of the wall along the U.S.-Mexican border, Cruz said. And there's a copy of the bill. All right, folks, so here's the deal. You've heard me say that the wall is nothing more than to distract, divert, to deceive. Now, why? Well, because there's endless amounts of money available to build a wall. I just posted a video and I talked about the governor of California and he's made a determination to no longer continue with the farce of the high-speed rail. And once that's finalized, California will owe the federal government over three billion dollars. Now we don't even need this money from El Chapo. There's three billion dollars there and Pelosi's agreed to give them close to two billion. So there's five billion, which should build most of the wall. It isn't a matter of the money. They have sufficient funds to build the wall without having to declare a state of emergency, without having to capitulate to what the Democrats want. It's all Kabuko theater, folks. That's all it is. That's all it's always been. It isn't any different than when Trump said, yeah, Hillary, when I become president, you need to go to jail. Drain the swamp! Drain the swamp! Drain the swamp! How many times did we hear that? How many times did we hear, believe me, believe me, believe me, believe me, huh? Folks, distract, divert to deceive. That's all it is. Again, there's ample funds, irrespective of what California does or doesn't do. There is no shortage of funds. It's just a big charade. Distract, divert, to deceive. I'll attach this link. You can take a look at it. You let me know what you think. You sure as hell know what I think. And you know why I think what I think, don't you? The link will be attached.